Hello friends, welcome to another video guide. Today we're going to be covering the Fanatic Skeptic locations as well as the laborer callers for the expedition from ashes to fire. It's very quick, so I hope you guys do enjoy. So let's get right into it. Now I won't be talking too much, but to start things off here when you grab all of your optional um, objectives, this is the closest entrance to Sanctum. Now. You might have a marker that might lead you to another location. I would say forget that, just go to this one. You're going to be going to the same place anyway. It doesn't change the outcome of anything. So, anyway, when you walk inside, I like to try and stick to the perimeter of the location. It's very rectangular um, and quite small. After a few runs, I always thought that this was a very large inside, but it's actually very, very small. So following this route should maximize the areas for you to hit, and I do believe I have found all the uh, locations that you can go to, or all the labor spawn points. Um, now it's not guaranteed that each and every one of these are going to spawn a caller, but it's always good to check. Now if you didn't know, this also works for union dues as well. For any of the optional objectives, when you get close to them, you will be able to get a marker on your compass. So, it's always good to keep a lookout on your compass when looking for these special or optional objectives. One thing that I would like to note is that a lot of these uh, rooms do have traps and turrets. So it's always good to kind of be aware of that. Uh, just in case, but honestly, they really don't do any damage besides the turrets. Uh, but yeah. Now, if you have the same instance like me where you only find four callers after doing this route, don't worry, you didn't miss anything. The fifth caller is located in another section of Sanctum called the Chapel. When I first uh, did this, the very first run, I was very confused and a little upset because it was kind of misleading. We sat for about an hour and a half wandering around this entire place thinking that the fifth caller was here at Sanctum. But there's a second part for the Chapel. And that is where you'll find the fifth caller if you don't find all five there. And the fifth caller is located on the second floor. When you follow this, it's very fast and uh, you'll be wanting to look for the, um, the little kiosks here or little tubes. Inside the middle one, you'll find the fifth caller. Now, once you grab all your callers and you have the fanatic to spawn inside of Sanctum, the chapel is where he's going to spawn. And these are some of the, uh, the locations that he has a chance of spawning, and it's always on the second floor. If you get it as um, the trench, or not the trenches, um, inside Sanctum, it's going to be quick. Now, for if you have him to spawn outside in the trenches, following this route will probably be the fastest way to get to both the spawn points. After doing many, many resets, as well as many, many ashes to fire to try and find all his locations outside of trenches, these are the only two spots that I managed to find. I'd also like to note that following this route here, leading up to the um, the road, is also the fastest way to get back to the Vertibird once you turn in all of your objectives. But now that you're here at the road, you want to take a right, and right next to that train cart or that uh, oil tank thing, uh, yeah, just behind there you'll be able to find um, the Fanatic. Now, if the fanatic doesn't spawn there, you just want to follow this street all the way down to the opposite side, up until you see um, a little turn in the wall. On the left hand side, once you uh, get to the end, you'll find the fanatic there as well. I highly recommend doing this before the end of the expedition. Um, and before you head into Sanctum, so you don't have to deal with the radiation, but it also does um, have a or he does spawn there as well afterward. But that about covers it, friends. Um, 
I wanted to make it quick and short, and I hope you guys found this information useful. If you guys have any questions, be sure to leave a comment. I will answer it as soon as I possibly can. And if you guys want to come and hang out in our uh, stream, we do stream on Twitch. Do um, a lot of expeditions, nukes, and all that other good stuff. So if you guys would like to come and join, you guys are more than welcome to. Um, but with that, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you so, so much for watching. And as always, happy hunting, good luck, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.